Hi, it's Bill the Handyman up here in Northern California. So, if your freezer has ice built up, this one has a lot of ice built up. And when your refrigerator is on, make sure that your control is turned on. And you hear the compressor running in the back which we won't right now because it's not plugged in. But if you hear the compressor running and you don't hear the circulation fan running in here, then that means the circulation fan is bad. Uh, and as well it could be a bad thermostat or bad heater. Most commonly it's going to be this circulation fan right here. So, and again it's going to, most commonly it's that third circulation fan. If it's not the circulation fan, it's going to be the thermostat that controls the heater, the defrost heater behind this panel. You have to take this panel off here in order to access the fan and the defrost thermostat. Not very likely it's going to be the heater, but the defrost heater occasionally will go bad. And then last but not least, it could be your thermostat or your uh, your defrost timer and you can access your defrost timer right through this port here um, if your refrigerator is not turning on at all if you stick a regular flathead screwdriver in there and turn it just a little bit it might come on uh, you just need to hear a click that's all you need to do to turn it just a one-way screw basically is what it is will not screw back the other way. It's a clockwise thread. So this is a Kenmore cold spot 60982991 and that's your tip for today. If you need any help you can contact me at appliancesworks at yahoo.com I also have a uh, How to Make Money in the Appliance Repair Business course, which includes a year of coaching and a link to over uh, 100 repair videos. And if you're interested in that, it's only $49.95, and you can send that to Bill's Enterprises, P.O. Box 7021. You can also contact me at 707-445-1591. Thank you.